Hello everybody, my name is Python and welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved from the Island. Back for the third episode, my friends. And once again, a massive huge thank you for all of the support you guys have been showing the series so far. Last episode, we reached well over a thousand likes. So, maybe let's make that a bit of a baseline goal. If we could continue on with a thousand likes per episode, that, my friends, would be enough to tell me that you guys are really, really enjoying the series. So, in today's episode, my friends, we're going to expand our base a little bit maybe just maybe make ourselves a little bit of a pen for all of these guys here our moss chops our parasaur and of course our hasperonis that we tamed all in the last episode and also we're gonna do a little bit of exploring now talking of exploring i discovered how to do something since the last episode guys so in the first two episodes we discovered that our map was pretty much all explored and that's because of my previous arc island series however i have discovered how to completely reset your map so guys i'm going to put a poll on screen would you guys like me to do a tutorial on how to reset your map data for your arc maps leave a vote on the poll. I'd be more than happy to do some arc tutorials here and there if you guys would like me to do some. Uh, because, yeah, there's some things in this game that require some strange things to do to reset stuffs. So, yeah, guys. Good times ahead. Good times ahead. So, here we go, my friends. We're starting off with a level up because we are amazing like that. Let's get ourselves just a little bit more health. And I'll tell you what, my friends. We are going to get ourselves the rest of the cloth armor and we're also going to get ourselves a cooking pot because I want to put that thing to the test with the Hesperonis egg. However, I think I actually accidentally ate it off camera. So, yeah, that's a thing that happened. Uh-huh. Right. Well, anyways, guys, let's go ahead and begin with the cloth armor, the hat, and, of course, the leggings. And we should be good to go on that front, guys. So, there we go. Let's get that on. Legs and head. Yep, looking pretty good. And guys, we're going to have ourselves full cloth armor, which, I don't know, it doesn't, like, replenish a whole bunch of stuff. But, eh, you know, it's better than nothing, isn't it, guys? It really, really is. So, let's go ahead and have a look how to make ourselves a cooking pot. Because I don't know that I, well, I'm pretty sure I have made one before, but I don't think I've actually used one before. So, it's going to be pretty interesting to see what kind of things we can discover. So, yeah, 20 stone more was what we needed. So, cooking pot, cooking spit, whatever you want to call it. We are now making one, and we are going to chuck it within the house of epicness. Oh, yes, we are. I think we're just going to, like, chuck it here, because why not, right? So here we go. There's the cooking pot, and we're going to, yeah, just, like, pretty much put it there. Okay, so what can we do with this thing? Boom. Must contain fuel to light the fire. Okay, light fire. Boom. Cool. Right. So then, we've got a turtle egg in there at the moment. I picked it up off camera. We've got ourselves a carbonemis egg. Tremendously nourishing by itself, this egg provides regular nutritional value in many cooking recipes. I don't know what that means. I've got to be honest with you. Maybe it will turn into something in here. I just don't know. I am not familiar with the cooking spit whatsoever, ladies and gentlemen. I'm really, really not. So if it does turn into something, then awesome. If not, then whatever. I'm not too fussed about it. Hmm. Cool. Well, anyways, let's go ahead and uh, keep chucking the poop in here. The more poop we store up, the better things are going to be later down the line if we want to make ourselves fertilizer, right? So, yeah, you may notice I've got a second campfire, a couple more chests in here now for a little bit more storage. Uh, so, yeah, basically, guys, we're looking pretty good in terms of our starter base here. What I want to do, though, is I want to add a little bit of a sort of fence kind of deal, like a little bit of an area for these guys to, like, just sit down, relax. All that kind of stuff without sitting on the sand here. I know they're used to it, but I want to give my dinos a better standard of living. Okay, that's what I want to do. I know it's totally pointless in the grand scheme of things, but god damn it, I want to do it, man. I do. I want to do it. Okay, so we basically need ourselves quite a lot of fiber thatch and wood. So here we go. Plenty of fiber and thatch, or so, sorry, wooden thatch from all of these bad boys. You know, not really that much of a hard ship to get a whole bunch of stuffs. So, yeah. The more of this stuff we can get, the better things are going to be. There we go. 113. Seems like a pretty reasonable amount. If we could make ourselves a sickle, that, my friends, would be amazing. But, uh, sadly, I don't think we're going to be able to do that for a little while yet. Uh, not until we've got uh, a workstation or anvil, whatever it's called these days. So, yeah. 
having a good time, my friends. We're having a good time. I'm kind of, I kind of liking taking this uh, series a little bit slower. You know, having you guys along for the journey with me. I think it's a good time. I do because maybe you guys can learn a thing or two along the way. So I hope you guys are okay with that. So we have ourselves yet another level up, which is very, very nice. Let's go for melee damage. Why not? And let's see what we have to unlock. We can start making ourselves wood stuff if we really wanted to. Wooden triangle foundation. Ooh. That's cool. Okay. Wooden foundation. Wooden triangle foundation. We could make ourselves a fence as well. Do we have enough? We've got 14. Interesting. Right. I'll tell you what. We'll go for thatch foundation. Then we'll have the... Oh. Wait, what do we need? What's the prerequisite? Oh, we do need the wooden foundation no matter what. So if we do want to put like proper fences up, then yeah. All right. We'll go for it. Why not? We do have arrows here as well. The spyglass could be pretty good as well. So we'll take that. Okay. So without further ado, we are going... I mean, we could make wood foundations, but to be honest, I don't really want to. We'll go for... Let's say six of these things. We'll have a little bit of a three by two kind of dealio going on out here. And then we'll put like fence foundations around it. I think that could look pretty cool. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so I'm going to need all of you guys to move then. Come on then. You all need to move over here so I can make you a little base. And then once we've done that, we'll have a little bit of an explore around the map. And see if we can't find ourselves some epic stuff. Because I don't know about you guys... I love epic stuff. Okay, I do. All right, so here we go. There's uh, that's an over raptor. We don't have to worry about those guys. They're not hostile, as far as I know. So yeah, guys, should be a pretty good time. So we're gonna continue placing down foundations, rather like this. And this is going to be the little dino area for them. I mean, like I say, give them a little bit better standard of living. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, get ourselves some fence foundations. Do fence foundations connect to regular foundations? I don't know. Oh, no, I don't think they do. Oh, dang, blast it. Uh, yeah, that's a bit sucky. Uh, I rather made a mistake here, in which case I could have just put walls up. Eh. Okay. I wasn't intending on having that be the case, but oh, well. Right, well, I guess we're just going for walls, then. We need ourselves... Wow, that's, that's really inexpensive. I just need thatch. All right, we'll get some thatch. We'll uh, make this little place... Oh. I don't mean to do that. Pick it up. Thank you. Hey, I like the fact you can pick things up rather like that now. It's very, very good. You don't have to just destroy it and get parts back. You can just pick it up straight out now, which is kind of cool. You do have a bit of a timer to do that. What the? Hang on. My gamma was up way too much there. Uh, but yeah, there was something weird going on over there. Right, we need what? Six? One, two, three, four, five, six, maybe seven actually? So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I think that'll do the job, guys. So, one wall here, and then one wall here, and the other walls are basically just going to surround this place here, and then we'll be having ourselves a rocking good time. We're going to be laughing, my friends. Here we go. Boom. And the other three are just going to go here, and then there we go. We've got our first goal done, my friends. I better stand of the living for my beautiful dinos. You know what I'm saying? Always got to love doing that. There we go. I could have just penned them in. But, you know, a bit boring doing that, isn't it? So, there we go. And I'm pretty sure this gal will still fit in here. So, here we go. Wow, she, like, takes up almost the entire thing just by herself. Hello. Right. Back up into the corner. Beep, beep. This dinosaur is reversing. There we go. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, why not? Just, uh, just put me outside of it. Why not? Buddy, come on. Up you come. You know you want to. Oh, look at this guy. Look at you. You're very cute. Right. Wait, what? How did... What? Go. Over that way. Yes. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Right, moss drops. You're going in here now, sir. Come on. Oh, wait, 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 wait. That's a, that's a Dilophosaur. Do we want to tame it? Guys, we're going to tame this Dilophosaur. Uh, yay! Go, 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 go. Level eight. Is that it? Yeah, do you know what? Boom! We can get better ones than level 8, okay? We could do better than level 8. It's a freaking Dilophosaur. Those guys are like the easiest thing in the entire world to tame. 
There is no reason why we can't get ourselves a high level Dilophosaur. Okay. So, yeah. Right. So, these guys are all good. Yep. Away you go. You're pooping again, you dirty bum. Uh, so, yeah. I mean, that was a bit of a waste of bowler. I won't lie. But, uh, yeah. We may need ourselves another club as well. So let's just pop in here real quick. And I need another club. It's in this chest here. Uh, yep. Wait, I didn't even... Eh, there we go. Got him. Right. Here we go, guys. We're going Dilophosaur hunting. And or any other dino we can find, okay? All right. Let's go for a little bit of an explore. Do we want to take a dino? I don't think Dilophosaurs are going to be that difficult to find. They're like one of the most common dinos on the island. Like anywhere you go. So, yeah. Let's just have a bit of a roam around her. Ah, so I actually did pick up a Hesperonis egg just now. I chucked it in here straight away, and there you go. It converted it almost immediately into oil. And is it me, or is that turtle egg a different color? I don't know. Either that or I'm remembering something wrong. Like a doofus. Oh, no, it's raining. Oh, no. I don't want rain. Rain sucks. We've had enough of that in the UK. Although, actually, at the moment, it's very, very hot in the UK. It's rather... Oh! Okay. That's a thing that just happened. There's dudes all over the place. Right, what are you? Oh, that's an Ichthyornis. Okay, right. Well, I should probably not hurt them. They haven't done anything wrong to me. So, yeah. Come on. Dilophosaur. We want to continue on our Pokemon quest to catch them all. Every single dino. Every single creature in the game. That's what we're looking for, guys. Come on. Come on, Dilophosaurs. Where the devil are you? Hello! I mean, are you... Are you a Chalicotherium, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh-oh. Ah! Ah! What? I will kill you, sir! Die, potato! Die! I will never die! Huh, I did it. Right. So, what do you got for me, sir? Absolutely jack diddly squat by the looks of it. However, wait, really? This guy is like furry. Oh, you can get prime meat from it. Okay, that's interesting. Okay, I can't be bothered to do anymore. Uh, yeah, I would have thought you'd get like pelt from those guys. Come on, one of these two have got to be like a decent level. Right, what are you? Level 24? Okay, I'm just going to kill you. There you go. Thanks. Oh, God. There's the other one. Ah, what level are you? 36. Okay, do you know what? Sod it. I'm going for level 36. Yee! Right. And get knocked out, you little butt head. I will smash you to pieces until you get knocked out. Out. Woohoo! The timing on that, my friends, was crisp. Perfect. Oh, God, I haven't got any entertainment with. Ah, oh, crap. All right. Hello. I'm going to kill you. Good day. What level are you? 36 as well. Dead. Goodbye. Don't try it. Get wrecked, you little bum. Right, here we go. Come on. Thank you. Right. Wait, what? What's going on? Oh, God. Access inventory? Huh? Oh, no, it is this one. Hey, 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 what's he done to you, you little bum? I will kill you for that. Yeah, 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 you go for him. Go for him. Go on, Polly. Teach him a lesson. Teach him a freaking lesson, or her. Teach her a lesson. Dead. Yeah. That's what you get. That's what you get. You dead. Huh, that was easy. Right, well, uh, with all of that out of the way, guys, we're going to get ourselves a level 36 Dilophosaur. Cool. All right, guys. That's pretty awesome. Hello. Right, and yeah, please enjoy all of your meat. Uh, wait, it is female, I think. So, D, uh, Delphine. <laughs> Delphine. <laughs> oh, God, what's she going to do? Start selling me bathwater? Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, God. I've turned into a meme channel, guys. That's not good. That's not good. Uh, Broski, Polly, you want to come over here? Come on. You know you want to. Right, let's have ourselves a level up real quick. Huh? A little bit more weight. We have ourselves um, so many engram points. All right, what are we going to get this time? Cementing paste. Good stuff. Very good to have. Uh, what else do we have here? We've got Ichthyornis saddle. Ooh. 
I can't remember how you tame Ichthyonises. But that's an underwater tame, isn't it? I've never tamed an Ichthyonis. As far as I can remember, I have never ever tamed one. Anyways, guys, uh, what do we want to do here? Standing torch? Bow? I don't know. There's a lot of things here we could take. I don't know, man. Standing torch, a little bit of light at night, never hurt anyone. Uh, maybe we could go for a wall. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of down with that. We can make a bit of a start on our wooden foundations here. Uh, so, yeah, don't mind if I do. Hey, broski. Right, we, my friendos, are off. Let's go home, huh? We're going to put out the Dilophosaur away. And we're only down here, actually, so that's kind of epic. Not far away at all. Yeah! Delphine! Going in for the kill. You love to see it. Right, what are you doing? Um, sir, you need to stay exactly where you are. Right, here we go. Got ourselves a bunch of dinos in here now. I'd like to be able to see them all, ideally. Right, and then, yep, that's cool. And then, yeah, we get popped out here because that's just how we roll. And, what? Hey, 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 Stay. Stay inside your pen. Huh? Go on. Stay. Right, and then, what the devil are you doing? You're floating. Well, I always knew that Delphine was magical. Jesus Christ. All right, all right. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, you can now come in here. Come on. In you come. Uh, what? What is What is wrong with you? Do you? Is there something wrong with you, sir? Or oh, ma'am? You need to come in here. Come on. Come on. Up you come. Up you come. Yeah. There we go. Cool. We got a Dilophosaur, guys. Awesome. Right. Is there anything else around here we could tame? There was an Overraptor. I don't know how to tame an Overraptor, whether it's like a knockout tame or a passive one. Uh, but there's definitely an Overraptor around here somewhere because I saw it with my own eyes. I did. I saw it. Where the devil is it? I don't know. I wonder. We have ourselves a level 40 Trillobite here. How does one tame a Trillobite? So they're not a passive tame. That much I know. I don't even know if I could bowl of them. I mean, do I just bash it with this? Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Go on. I don't even know if this is going to work. I, I literally don't know. Oh, God. Yeah, my stamina is going to get drained here, my friends. Come on! Uh! What, the, what the hell was that? Come on! I, I, I don't even know if this is possible. What? Oh, Jesus! What am I supposed... Oh, that's smart. You're using the ichthy sauce. I can't do anything. All of these guys are in the way. What the crap? Oh, no. Well, I mean... If it does work, then cool. We can tame a Trillo bite. I don't even know what they do. If not, then we'll move on to the Overraptor, I guess. Alrighty guys, so a quick search on the ARC wiki and it tells us that we can tame them with a fish basket which has gotten on aberration, so not this map, which means I could do this without feeling guilty. I'm sorry there sir, but you, my good friendo, need to die. I want all of your resources because they're very good. Right, there we go. Cool! Right, so yeah, apparently you can't tame them unless you've got a fish basket. Hmm, interesting stuff, huh? All right, well, uh, I'll take all... Of oh, wow, look at all this stuff I'm getting. Yeah, boy. Not bad, not bad. All right, guys, so back to the Overraptor, huh? Come on, Overraptor, final goal. Well, guys, maybe that'll be a no on the Overraptor for now because apparently they take eggs. And eggs are a little bit difficult to find. We don't really have any way of, like, taming or, or, like, farming eggs at this particular juncture just yet. I mean, yeah, we could get lucky and just find them dotted around the world. The larger the egg for the larger the dino, the better, typically. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I'm not entirely sure. So, let's go for the old favourite, shall we? Hello! I'm going to knock you out. Goodbye! Go on! Accept. Accept your fate. There you go. Simple tame, huh? Right, access inventory. Let's give you some of those. And that should do the job. What level are you there, good buddy? Level four. You're basically useless to me. Okay, so now we got to wait. 49%. This guy or gal or guy, it is a guy. It'll be level 71 upon being tamed. That's not bad, guys. So two animals tamed in today's episode. That's pretty good going, if you ask me. All right, looking pretty cool, man. Yeah. Are we going to get ourselves a level up on this? I don't think so. I don't think dodos give you a lot of XP when being tamed because they're like the lowest thing. 
<laughs> Dave. Dave the Dodo. There we go. All right, Butsky. All right, pick up. Whee! You, my good sir, can come across here. Wait, can I, like, swim with a dodo? No, you can't. Okay. Uh. <laughs> what? It's just stuck there. Oh, no, no, it is following me. <laughs> what? That's weird. I don't know, man. But, yeah. Over raptors. Definitely going to be one of the more difficult things to try and tame, huh? So you use eggs to tame them, but then upon being tamed, they will eat meat just like any other dido. So, yeah. Kind of interesting, I guess. Anyways, let's pick you up and let's put you in the pen. There we go. Number five. Oh, if only I could get a pego back. <sighs> it died in the last episode, didn't it, guys? It'd be nice if I could get it back, but no. I don't think it's going to work. There you go. Cool. Right. And now you've got to, like, stay here. Uh, attack my target. Let's go neutral. Cool. Look at that little smorgasbord of... Uh, sir, you need to stay there. We've got a little smorgasbord of dinos, guys. This is cool. I like it. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 hey. Come on, then. Come on, then. I'm ready. Yay! Oh, no. Didn't work. You little son of a gun. I'm going to kill you. I will. I will absolutely destroy you. Damn it! Ah, you're annoying, sir. Oh, you! What? Oh no! Uh oh! Not good! Not good! Not good! What? Don't poop in the water. Now's not the time. Right. Come on, then. I'm ready. I'm ready. Come on. Just swing around this way. I'm the best spearsman you'll ever meet in your entire life. But, do you know what? You don't appear to be coming back over us. So, I'll tell you what. Let's get you two to come back in the pen, huh? Stupid idiots. I want my spear back. How dare you steal my spear? That is unbelievably rude. Uh, yeah, buddy. Yeah, you need to come back as well. Come on. <sighs> what is wrong with these people? Right. Yep. Okay. So, we've got Dolphin. And we've got Dave. Let's pick you up and chuck you in the corner. There you go, and then, wait. Where's the last guy? Where's the Hesperonis gone? What? Harriet the Hesperonis has gone missing! What? Legitimately, I can't see her. Is she in the corner? Oh, she's still in the corner. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh dear. Alright guys, well anyways, I think what that's going to do is that is going to do it for today's episode. So I want to thank you guys for watching. If you guys have enjoyed today's episode, please, as always, do be sure to drop a like rating. Hit the subscribe button and ding that bell if you guys don't want to miss out on future content. But I think next episode we're going to work on the base a little bit more. Maybe make it a little bit bigger. Get ourselves a proper dino pen. Maybe even try to get some, uh, you know, alternate uh, sex versions of each of the dinos we've got. So if we've got a male, we'll try and get a female and so on and so forth. Maybe that way we can get ourselves some eggs to eventually feed an oviraptor, right? I feel like that'd be a cool idea to go. So, you know be kind of cool get ourselves a little bit of an egg farm i think that's a good idea so guys subscribe if you don't want to miss out future arc content but for now my friends that's gonna wrap it up thank you guys very much for watching have a fantastic rest of your day and i'll see you guys in the next episode